Meet the majestic Harpy Eagle, a raptor so large you may mistake it for someone in costume. Speaking about big birds, if you thought birds like the albatross or some eagles were big, wait till you see the Harpy Eagle. It's widely known that the Harpy Eagle is one of the largest birds in the world and looks just like Fox the Phoenix from Harry Potter. Today we will meet the Harpy Eagle, a fierce hunter of monkeys and slots living in the Manu region of Peru. Number 1. The Harpy will make your jaw drop. When people see photos of the Harpy Eagle, the first reaction is jaw dropping. The bird is massive. It looks proud, majestic and fierce because of its searing eyes. Looking larger than life, the harpy has a steely look in its eyes and seems to be always staring suspiciously at you. It seems to say, don't mess with me. Keep your distance as I eat people like you for breakfast. Number 2. It looks as if it is a human in cosplay. One big peculiarity about the harpy eagle is that it looks weird from the side, as if someone was in a cosplay costume. From another angle, it looks like a character from Pokemon. In some instances, it also looks like an alien who may have escaped from Area 51 and who may have come from some other planet. Number 3. It's native to the rainforests of Central America, but the numbers are dwindling. On a factual note, the harpy is a bird of prey native to the rainforests of Central America, namely Brazil. They can be found mainly in the upper canopy layer of tropical lowland forests and sadly their numbers have dwindled drastically due to encroachment of its habitat. There are hardly 50,000 left in the wild. In Brazil, the harpy is also known as the royal hawk. It is said that such a beautiful bird is dwindling in numbers. Number 4. The harpy's talons are not to be trifled with. As per fact figures, the prey of the harpy usually consists of large prey like monkeys, tree porcupines, slots, codies, snakes, lizards and other birds. And no, people are not on their list of prey. Interestingly though, the female of the species is much bigger than the male. Number 5. The History of the Harpy Historically speaking, harpies were found before in southern Mexico through Central and South America. They were also found in Argentina but slowly started disappearing because of habitat destruction and natives shooting them. Panama is where harpies are now being bred extensively, although they are now extinct in El Salvador and one pair was earlier observed in Belize. Number 6. What they do The harpy is a very family-oriented bird. It may be intimidating with talons and legs as thick as a man's wrists, but then it hunts down sloth monkeys with agility and strength that none have seen before. The harpy chooses a mate for life and shares parenting duties lifelong. It also cares for chicks for the first two years of their lives. Number 7. The Peregrine Fund Helps the Harpy Increase the Peregrine Fund in 1989 helped the numbers of the harpy increase after breeding them in captivity and then returning them to the rainforests. The project gained support from several Latin countries that donated eagles to zoos around the world. Number 8. 50 harpies have been released in the wild since 1998. The breeding program for the harpies was set up in the Fund HQ in Boise, Idaho, where exact replicas of their habitats were constructed right up to the right amount of sunlight, temperature and humidity, along with cooperation from the Neotropical Raptor Center and breeding facility in Panama City, Panama in 2001. 17 harpy eggs hatched in one year alone. Since 1998, more than 50 harpies have been released in the wild. Thanks to the Peregrine Fund that has gained enough knowledge about harpy, the world will not lose the bird. Like many other exotic species in the wild, the harpy will survive. There is no doubt about that. Thank you for watching the video. Hope you liked the video and don't forget to share your views in the comment section below.